get out your pitchforks and torches. Time for tonight's worst persons in the world. But our winner, Rupert Murdoch, and his president for station operations for Fox, Dennis Swanson. For a long time, the one saving grace of the fixed news propaganda machine was that it did not extend to the local stations Murdoch owns, like Channel 5 in New York, Channel 11 in Los Angeles. Oh, well, you can forget the one saving grace. Multiple industry sources say that within the last six weeks or so, local news directors at the local Fox O&Os have been receiving memoranda and emails from Swanson and other executives, and even from Murdoch himself, content directives, they're called, to make the local news on Fox broadcast stations around the country look and sound just as shaded, just as biased as that on Fox News Channel. An example. Last month, all the Fox O&Os were informed it would be a good idea to do a man-on-the-street segment for which the question was provided by Fox News headquarters. Half of Americans think President Obama is not doing a good job. What do you think? So let the propagandizing begin. And soon this will no longer be the unintentional slogan of the local newscast on the Fox station in your city. Takes a tough man to make a tender forecast, Nick. I guess that's me. <laughs> Keep <laughs> that chicken. <laughs> That will now be replaced with, keep bleeping that Obama. Rupert Murdoch and his local station's chief, Dennis Swanson, today's worst persons in the world.